Hey guys, Machines and Mallow here on this beautiful June 1st at the farm. Sun's shining and the chickens are chickening and the weather is beautiful, it's warm. And anyway, I uh, just wanted to show you this uh, MTD brand, MTD Pro, Honda powered stainless steel self propelled rear bagger lawnmower I picked up. So if you remember the last video I posted, I showed you a um, trailer load of lawnmowers I got from a scrap pile. And uh, this is one of those mowers, guys. This was uh, one of the first ones I pulled out. And I actually, it was missing the bag when I found it, but I found this this white outdoor, which actually white, I believe is, is owned by MTD um, bag on another mower that I was gonna scrap because the deck was rotten, but this one's got a hole in it. And I actually found, guys, this bag, which I think, I'm not 100% sure, but I think this is the bag that these mowers came with when you bought them new. Um, <clears throat> I had this in my stash of bags, because everyone has to have a stash of bags. But that's not the point of this video. Anyway, the point of this video was, I took a look at this mower and I thought, you know what, it's a beautiful day. I might as well fix a lawnmower to sell, and I thought this would be a good one to fix because it's a nice mower, it's in good shape, it looks like it's in good shape. Um, hopefully there's not a whole lot wrong with it. And then I noticed something, guys. When I look at it, tell me if you notice it as well. I mean, obviously, obviously the engine cable is disconnected. You can see that. But what else do you see there, guys? Just look at that. Tell me. Oh, look at that. The fuel's turned off, guys. That's a very common problem on these Honda engines. People turn the fuel off on them for the winter time, and then in the spring, they forget that it's turned off, and this baby won't start because the fuel's turned off. It might start and run briefly, but then it'll die because there's no fuel running from the tank down into the carburetor. And you can tell this is turned off because when this thumb tab is in the up and down position, so the 12 o'clock and 6 o'clock position, that fuel is turned off. So now it's on. And I have a hunch, just a hunch, this video might be a waste of time. Actually, it'll be a good start to fixing this lawnmower because I don't think there probably is all that much wrong with it. But I have a hunch that this baby might start. So if we connect the cable back up, like that, now the engine bar works. And uh, theoretically, if there's gas in it, there is gas in it, um, things should start. So let's put the choke on. And uh, I'm gonna try and pull start this thing. If this, if this thing starts, guys, I don't even really have to wash it, man. I might just check the blade out. Sorry, like check it out, sharpen it. Um, I'm not sure how the oil is. The oil is like super clean, guys. This is a really good sign. We might have a hundred and I want to say two hundred dollar lawnmower here. Might be able to post this for two hundred dollars and get uh, twenty percent of my investment back. Oops, I just let out of the bag how much all the lawnmowers cost me. Well, anyways, but let's uh, let's uh. Let's just give, I'm going to try and pull start this with um, my phone. This isn't going to work. Hang on. Let me try something here. Okay. I don't know. I'm just going to put that there, guys. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, you kind of can see a lot more. I'm going to try and start this baby. Let's see what happens. guys I tell you nothing wrong with this lawnmower the um, sorry I still got the rope in my hand it had been taken off the little loop here the handlebar loop the drive even works guys I'm just honestly I'm not surprised I'm being obnoxious for the film but you get what I mean someone someone took this down to the repair shop with the fuel turned off and 
the guy at the shop said it was going to cost more to fix than it was worth. So they abandoned it, said put it in the scrap pile, we'll just buy a new one. And uh, there's probably absolutely nothing wrong with this lawnmower. We're going to do a little service, clean it up with a rinse and some citrus cleaner, throw that, oops, throw that bag on there, and I'm going to post this baby for 200 and, 225 bucks. And I bet you she'll sell in the next couple days for two bills. Anyway, one man's junk is another man's treasure, I guess. It just blows my mind that stuff like this gets thrown in the garbage. So, well, hit the subscribe button. There's a lot more mowers coming like this, guys. Uh, we picked up two dozen in, um, on the weekend, and I'm going to go pick up another two dozen or so this coming weekend. And I think I'm going to do the same thing two more times. I think there's about 75 lawnmowers incoming on this deal. And... Uh, yeah. Hey guys, I just had to turn the camera back on one more time because I gave this thing a wash. Just wanted to show you how nice it turned out. And it looks like new. Beautiful lawnmower, guys. So I posted her online and uh, I put her for 250 It's a little bit high. I've already had about... Uh, five or six responses in the last hour and a half for it and they're gonna start showing her off this weekend she'll make somebody make somebody a happy lawnmower owner when she goes home and works all right hit the subscribe button thanks for watching